I've got a confession to make this hey! evening. Hey! That's not a good thing. Okay, it's bad. You'll see why. Yeah. I basically got a bit of an addiction. Uh, and Glyn knows about his addiction. I do indeed. And yeah. I thought the best way to face his addiction would be to just present it to a room of 70 people that I don't really know. So you just all start to judge me, really. This is a special uh, addiction light. <laughs> now, um, I have an addiction to the following magazines. You'll find out, Leon. You will find out. And this is ruining my life. Uh, basically, it all started when I was on my way to work one day, and I popped into news agents, and I spied this headline. 46 L hell, my boobs are like a bum. <laughs> We've actually talked about this before, haven't we, this headline? This is true, yeah. it's true, yeah. And basically, it's taken over my life. Now, whenever I see these magazines, I have to take a picture of the cover, and I have to text it to Glyn. Yes, she does. Yes. Uh, some other favourites include Hacked in Half as I Sat on the Loo. <laughs> And um, Glyn's personal favourite, my pop belly went bang. Um, shall I actually read a bit of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well. Okay, it starts like this. So, no one took Kerry Ann Barrett's protruding stomach seriously until the day it burst. <laughs> What's going on in there? That's that one. Yeah. Uh, now, basically, I thought the best way to kind of quell this addiction would be to present to you, the people here at Mostly Comedy, the top ten cover stories from these magazines. Yeah. Can you hack that? Yeah. Excellent, we've got nothing else planned. So, here we go. When the sound cue's ready, Mr. Dobby, here we go. Not our pop figures, here we have the top ten. At ten, he left Mum scalp in a lay-by, but where was the rest of her? At number nine, naked killer lay cuddling my dead mum. At eight, rapist was living in my shed. He cut spy holes in the door to watch me. Number seven, pop, I broke my waters with a kebab skewer. My boob oozed away is a new entry at number six. At number five, my baby had no eyes, but I thought he was sleeping. <laughs> at number four, cut into chunks by the house husband from hell. Sorry you were left rotting, Dad replaces my man-made vagina at number three. And number two, Hubby's Horrible Secrets, Something Dead in the Shed. Which means we have a brand new entry for you, a new number one. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for my boo bursting Morrison. Oh, yeah. Bang.